Hey there, signs of Capricorn. This is Kim here to do a reading for you all for the Lionsgate portal, which opened today at 7:28 to um, 8:12 is when it's open the whole length of time. It is the Sun in Leo, and that being aligned with the brightest star of Sirius, which is out for, well, for me during the day. All right, so we should have already been starting to feel this. This energy brings lots of rapid manifestation abilities, heightened manifestation abilities. Um, it can bring emotions that are either really, really high or really, really low, sad to really happy. Just kind of maybe confusing emotions. Um, it might feel like you're being pushed through a threshold into something brand new and that's fine it's supposed to be a birthing type process through this portal you're ascending you're going higher it could be uncomfortable but change is is going to be inevitable in order to get you to move forward and ascend to accelerate you so it's kind of like I, I think of the eight of wands um when i think of what's going on right now in this portal okay so spirit guides angels higher self let's get some messages for capricorn already right off the bat we're doing we're gonna do a celtic cross by the way a general read um you're on the bottom justice justice is the situation card this could be a libra okay uh, this is a few things it could be a person sitting in their truth honoring their truth and keeping their life in balance and by that i mean like work play balance um eating how you eat how you exercise it can be about keeping things in balance strict balance um, or it can be about karma. It can be about um, somebody receiving karma. Or just making a situation fair and balanced, actually. So something might not be fair at the moment. And this could be going to like a court situation. Or, or just making something fair and even and balanced. Making something balanced is the biggest message. Okay, the challenge. Four of Cups in reverse because you're almost over it over um, making a situation and maybe that feels okay so that might be perseverance that you're needing because it might feel like you're over a situation on the bottom and it might be a situation in which a big decision was made and maybe you feel that was an incorrect decision or a bad decision could be a partnership that's not working out now for some reason one reason or another maybe the justice is about coming to some kind of crossroads or agreement we have twin flame energy that I feel too from that for the past energy, judgment, forgiveness, being able to move on and let go of really heavy emotions like anger and resentment and things like that. So moving forward and um, it's like mirroring, big time mirroring, possibly the twin flame mirroring thing here too. Okay, we have three swords, it's kind of like this. so. Either we're healing and getting out of this heartache or it's just something that is pretty recent. It, either way, it could be reverse or upright. It really doesn't matter. This could be Sagittarius. So getting justice, um, making things even, maybe after an announcement was made. What's the present energy here for Capricorn? Wheel of Fortune and springing good luck, good fortune to you. And I, it, it seems like so something that you're going after justice or something something you're going after is going to end up pretty 
good. Like with the Wheel of Fortune here, that's good. For space, I'm going to put it there. So the Six of Swords and the Three of Cups. Moving away from a bad situation or something that was really um, like, oh gosh, I got to leave and I got to leave now. It might have not even been planned. Um, Three of Cups, present energy, celebrating, going out with friends, celebrating abundance, having reunions, going out with friends, making good memories, applauding and celebrating this good luck. We have Aquarius, Scorpio, Taurus, and Leo that correspond with the Wheel of Fortune in the near future. So we have you celebrating two of Pentacles, <laughs> ten of Pentacles. In the near future, you're not going to end up doing stuff alone. Okay, you'll be celebrating even more because you're going towards a completion, big finances, material wealth. This is going to be very good for you. Ten of Pentacles is going to be kind to you in the personal wealth and riches, the family legacy, the emotional fulfillment. Paired with the Two of Pentacles in reverse is clearly that um, you won't have to feel like you're doing something alone. There's going to be value and wealth abundance in, in this near future energy. So what is the... Um, so what's the how you are feeling how are you feeling queen of cups all right so you're feeling a little bit into your heart here you feel a little compassionate maybe it's a cancer scorpio or pisces but capricorn i think this is you getting in touch with the soft side of you your heart so you're feeling very loving you're feeling compassionate kind you're feeling like you're ready to receive this abundance in happiness and joy and celebration and in family making something even but also bringing in this amazing amount of wealth okay so let's go for this situation around capricorn ace of wands in the reverse you're not feeling this energy quite yet quite yet because we're being inspired to get out of a situation or we're trying to make something work that worked in the past but it's not going to work now for some reason i don't know something's happened to the passion and motivation it's the hope and fear here so this is about perseverance this whole spread all right wait, waiting for somebody to come back in from a journey Remember, it is hopes, too, and it could be anticipating, anticipating um, the stuff, you know, things to come into you because we have, yeah, the Queen of Cups is how you feel. So you're feeling like here I'm open to receive and I'm ready to receive. <clears throat> All right. And the outcome, projected outcome for Capricorn. The King of Swords. Justice, truth, getting control over a situation. Moving away from a really bad situation. Now, th this energy, King of Swords, could be like an authority like over a matter or something like that with this justice. It could represent counsel. It can represent the truth, getting to the truth. It can also be somewhat of a manipulative person if it's um, like a character in your life that is manipulative or um, using their intelligence to tell you things. I don't think this is that's your outcome, though, because I'm not going to go negative on this. King of Swords is having control and power back into your life or into a situation maybe revolving this lover's issue or family issue. We also have seven of pentacles with the three of cups and the ace of sword or ace of yeah eight of swords so we're worried a little bit about a choice or decision that we had to make or have to make and i feel like we know what our investment is so far and you're really questioning on whether something was either worth it or um contemplating what to do next when this stuff comes in 
So it is harvest that you're looking at. All right, so Capricorn on the bottom, we have the Eight of Swords. Let's get um, let's get some clarifying cards and try to find out some of this information, like some extra information. Um, what is this lovers as at the base, the lovers and this past Three of Swords about? Um, okay, a passionate new beginning that ended in heartache with that Three of Swords in the past position. I think that is the queen, the queen of cups, the same as. Wow, so there's gonna be something about unconditional love, support, family, uh, and wealth. Something big about wealth and self-care, increase in self-care. All right, at, um, King of Swords. I would like to find out more about the King of Swords. The Two of Pentacles, the Two of Wands. Two of Pentacles, Two of Wands. <laughs> Balancing something, going after, getting your drive, your motivation, inspiration back. Partnerships, good decisions. Balancing act. Ups and downs, but in control of these things. New job. Moving away from a bad thing. All right, guys. That's what I've got for you. Thanks so much. Um, sending you love and light. Subscribe and you will get more readings in between the bigger ones. Bye.